Challenge problem number four for gases. And let's make this a little larger and we'll get her going. Okay, I think that works pretty good. We have 3.5 liters of neon gas at 380 millimeters mercury in zero degrees Celsius. It's subjected to a pressure increase of 760 millimeters mercury and a temperature increase of 30 degrees Celsius. What will be the final volume? Okay, this looks like I got liters is a volume, millimeters mercury is a pressure, zero degrees Celsius is a temperature. And it looks like I got another pressure and another temperature. So I got to find a volume. So this definitely looks like a P1, V1, T2 equals P2, V2, T1 problem. Notice the 3.5 liters, the 380 millimeters mercury, and the zero degrees Celsius all go together under as initial conditions right here. So I wrote the pressure, the volume, and the temperature there. Okay, um, maybe just one adjustment to this is we can do um, pressure in millimeters mercury as long as this other pressure is in millimeters mercury. We can do volume in liters as long as the other volumes in liters. We always have to use Kelvin for our temperature because Kelvin is a scale with a zero basis, where zero is as cold as it gets. So I'm going to add 273 to this one right here. And um, maybe I'll just do a little line here. And then we'll change that. And we'll call that 273, 7. Oh, that's pretty slow. 3. And then we'll do a Kelvin. OK. Now notice there's a trick here when we do our pressure, final pressure and final temperature. It doesn't say the final pressure is 760. It says an increase of 760. Okay, just like if you're making $15 an hour and you got a $5 increase per hour, you wouldn't be making $5, you'd be making 15 plus five, which would be 20. So in this case, we're gonna take the 380 and add 760 to that. And I believe that is 1140 millimeters mercury. Okay, so let me just get that in here and I'll call that 1140. Whoops. Let me try that again. 1140 mmHg. Notice what happened. We had what an increase of 760, so we added 380 plus 760, which is 1140. Um, our temperature increase is 30 degrees. Now, really, a 30 degree increase in Kelvin and, and Celsius is the same amount, okay, because they both go up in the same increments. You just start at a what at zero with degrees Celsius, where it's 273 Kelvin. So we are increasing it by 30 degrees. So it'll be either 30 degrees Celsius, which is 303 Kelvin, or 273 Kelvin. And again, we'd add 30 degrees because a change of 30 degrees Celsius is the same as a change in 30 degree Kelvin. So I'm going to call this 303 Kelvin right there. OK. All right, so now we know what P1, V1, T1, P2, P2. We can look at our formula. We're solving for V2. So the P2 and the T1 go in the denominator. And now we just have to plug in the numbers. So let's take a look at that. And I am going to grab this over here and say uh, V2. is going to equal, oops, let's be equal. And then in the numerator, I'm gonna put the P1, which is 380. And I'll just say times 3.5 times. And then it's, I'm gonna go and take P2 
D1, V1, and then T2 is the 303. So I don't take the 273, I take the 303. Okay. And then I'm going to divide that by the little line here. And that's going to be P2, which is 1140. And then times, and then that is going to be 273. And we're going to see what that equals. Whoops, I'm signed right there. But the 1140 would be the P2, and the 273 would be the T1. And we get, now just one thing when I do this on my calculator, I can multiply the top three. Now I have to divide by the last two, or I can put parentheses around this in the denominator when I do it. And then I should get an answer of 1.3 liters. Now I think if the temperature went up, it should get slightly bigger volume. However, the pressure goes down by what? By a factor of threefold. So that should make the volume a lot smaller. And notice the volume is almost a third of what it was before. A little bit bigger because of the temperature rise, but that seems to make sense. So 1.3 liters would be the final answer here. So the hint here is again, if it says increase of, add it to the original, millimeters mercury. Same thing here, increase of, add it to the original temperature. All right, thank you for watching.